Okay. This is democracy. And this is the lawsuit. Is the, the title's lawsuit? Now, there's a bit of humor in here. It's like uh, gallows humor, or the kind of thing that if you ever actually worked in a factory floor, or done anything that uh, couldn't kill what, you. What working class people do. This, this, this. The, she brings it up, but she brings it up in a, a typical, arrogant, disgusting way. Is ah, uh, ah. Uh, these people, but you'll hear it, and then at the end, we can talk about it for a second. In Waterloo, Iowa, a wrongful death lawsuit accuses Tyson Foods of willful and wanton disregard for workplace safety at a pork slaughterhouse that led to over a thousand workplace infections and at least five deaths. The family of meatpacker Isidro Fernandez, who died of COVID-19 April 20th, alleges in an amended lawsuit that, quote, plant manager Tom Hart organized a cash buy-in, winner-take-all bedding pool for supervisors and managers to wager how many plant employees would test positive <laughs> for COVID-19. Well, of course we have that going on. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong well, she with that? finds it's apprehensible. Oh my goodness! Yeah, I'm sure they talk real purdy there on the floor of democracy now. Um, so, so these guys at this at this this supervisor supervisors doesn't mean it. She makes it sound like they're the you know corporate shareholders or something. We're talking about you know the the foreman. Yeah. The guy say, hey, "Get move faster over there! You're, you're slowing down the line." Okay, yeah, guy. yeah, those guys. But those, those are super, you know, these are high end supervisors. The way she puts it, of course they would put together a dead pool. Hello, it's what you do. It's what you do because it's like, what else you got to do? What else are we going to bet on this week? They, they like to bet. They, they can't. There's no football. Basketball season's over. You can't put those together. Got to so bet on this. something. <laughs> I thought it was hilarious. Personally, I don't know what she was all upset about. Some more news you.